We got the eight bugs. And now it's time to climb this mountain. We got the shield. We got the piece of heart. There's no other piece of heart I think we can get. So that's exciting. Alright. Um, I don't know how long this episode's gonna be, but I say we extend it a little bit by going up here. Of course, I'm saying that without not even realizing what the hell I'm saying, because who knows? This could be, like, in the middle of an episode, as far as I know. Depends on where I cut it. Because in this game, and all the other games I, I play, obviously, I don't stop until I, um... Let's get the iron boots on, because we're gonna have a cutscene here. I think you can actually put it on while he rolls, but I don't, I don't know. Yeah, you can. Okay. Get your iron boots on, press A when it tells you to, hold A... And the Goron will go down and apparently keep rolling until you, uh, he, until he goes off screen, I guess. I don't know. Uh, obviously, Pona can't come up here, so we're going to have to... Whoa, here we go. Iron boots. A, I miss. Luckily, he will not fall down, so we can just kind of keep going. Uh, let's, let's get rid of this guy, because I don't want to pretend that I'm not... I don't know how to do this or not. Oh, what not? Alright, so he's gonna kinda keep rolling down the mountain. Oh, here comes another one. You think you can stop me? I don't think so. Yeah. I'll iron boot you out of here, boy. We can take this nice little shortcut. I think you can also climb that thing over there, but... Who wants to do that? Come on. Seriously now? Alright, I think we're done with that for now. Oh, great. Yes, we're gonna have these idiots fire and fire arrows at us. But you know what? I don't really care. We can't do anything about them anyway. I just want to get to the next, uh... Dungeon, to be honest. <laughs> Excuse me? Did I say you can just fire hot air for no reason? No. area seems more dangerous than it was before. Oh, they seem to be having a conversation. Oh, what are they, what are they doing? Oh, okay. That's how they go on to get up there. They use their powers. Before, of course, we do anything, let's create the cutscene. Oh, God. Well. That's very... Om om ominous. Whoa, that looks dangerous. This is, is this the traditional Death Mountain welcome? Eh, it could be. You never know. Um, the way to get up is... Fight the Gorons, of course. You can use your sword or the shield attack. And once you get on top, just aim for the direction you want to go, and you will go up. Really not that hard. Uh, we have to go up a different way than before. We gotta use this guy. No, shield. Shield attack. Shield attack, and then sword. That's what you need to do. And sometimes, just you know, get on top of him instead of just doing something stupid. Thank you. Am I going in the right direction? Am I supposed to be going this way? I don't think so. I think we're going in the wrong- wait, are we? Let's keep going and then let's see where I'm going here. I don't think this is the right way, but we'll see. Nothing tells me this is leading me to the hot springs, which is not the way we need to go. Yeah, we did- EXCUSE ME! Yeah, we're going into the water. Which is fine, because I need to get some health anyway. Morning baths are the best. I love greeting the sunrise from the tub, brother. Okay. Sitting in the hot spring warms up your body and soul and gradually fills up with your energy. Yes. Yes, it does. There's actually a shop here. You know what? We're not going to need lantern oil, I think, in this next area. And I can't even do anything because I don't have my lantern out, so... No. I'm out. 
Why can't I... I know it makes no sense to do that, but I'm gonna do that anyway. There's actually a shop over here. Somewhere. There it is. Yes, okay, he's talking about sumo. We'll get into sumo in a little bit later here. Because we still have to fight the sumos. Oh, we can buy lantern oil here, but I think I'm gonna buy the... Oh, you don't have a red potion, boy. I thought you had a red potion. You know what? Let's just get the stupid milk. You got milk! Alright. I thought that shop had a red potion. But I guess not. You know what did have red potion, though? The, um... What? Oh, we can't do anything with that. I know where that is, too. Which is stupid. Because that would just lead us right to where we need to go anyway. I don't want to... How do I, how do I get out of here? Is it over here? Uh, no, it's right here. Alright, let me climb this. Alright, well, I think I might have lied when I said that was the end of the video because this is taking longer than I thought to get up here. Yeah, I think I went up the wrong Goron, too. Wait a minute. No, this is where I want to go. We want to fight this guy. Okay, you want to use the shield attack. Wait, hold on. Let me, let me just... Shield. No, shield. 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 Hit him with the sword. There we go. <laughs> Stop rolling into him and get on top of the stupid thing. You don't have to press A to get on top of him. You just have to, uh... You just have to move. Uh, let's get the iron boots on because I think that's the only way. You know what? Let's just put this here. I don't care if I accidentally use this stupid thing. Alright. Let's be careful that we don't hit any unfortunate accidents here. Uh, I don't care about you, so you can just... Kill me, I don't care about you. So, whoa, that was a freaking huge hit. I'm not expecting that. Yeah, you can't dodge those guys, but like I said, there's no reason for you to even worry about that. Alright. Yes. The game tells you to use the shield attack, so you might as well do it. Alright, let's get up here. Hello! Excuse me, I wasn't even ready yet. So, because of that, you must die. Yeah, you just gotta press forward. See, I was trying to roll into him and all this other nonsense. But here we go. We're going over here. Oh, I should have. Let's put these on. Oh, God. We're gonna ready get ready because we're gonna. Enough! Oh, I guess we're not going to uh, battle those guys. Is this the young one such an opposing enemy that you must all get up on him? I think not, little brothers. Are you more like brothers? I am Goron Elder, little human. I am called Kor Kor Gor Koron. Because of certain circumstances, I must lead the Goron tribe in place of Darvis, our tribal partridge. Tell me, little human, do you come from the village below? Do you have you have done well to come this far? You are strong for a human. However, the mines beyond here are sacred to my tribe. Outsiders are not allowed, unless... He's so happy. I could make an exception, but you m would have to beat me in a contest of power. Are you willing to try that, little human? Yes. Okay, so here we go. This is what we've been training for when we uh, battled our, the mayor of our town. And that was probably t three episodes at this point. But that's okay. So if you put the iron boots on before you enter this area, before you the ensued the cutscene, you should be able to do this in one try. Because if you just, if you activate the cutscene, you won't be able to put on the iron boots in this fight. So... And obviously, um, having it on is a lot easier in the beginning because you don't have to go through of losing because you would automatically lose. 
young warrior. You have strong will and sharp eyes. And a cheat in footwear, but that's okay. Fine traits. I want to see how well you can use them. Alright. You have seen it, I would bet. The mountain erupting without pause. When the mountain began to rage, all four of us elders and Darbus, our partridge, went inside to investigate its anger. We have a treasure that was entrusted to us by the spirits, and we must protect it. Do you understand? But the moment Darbus reached out and touched the treasure, everything went wrong. He collapsed, and before our very eyes transformed into an unspeakable monster, he began to rage through the mines, trailing ruin behind him. And the eruptions grew more frequent and more severe. We use all of our strength to steal him deep inside the mountain. It breeds us to do this to our partridge, but we had no other course of action. I asked this favor of you, young warrior. Go and aid of Darbus. Make no mistake, the spirits have guided you here. I, Kor Kor uh, Gor Koron, need your help. On behalf of the entire clan, I ask you for your aid. You two! Let the young warrior pass. Hooray for two steps instead of a butt wiggle that takes ten minutes. Okay. Um, well, that's gonna do it for this recording session, I guess. I don't wanna obviously start a temple. Um, right now. I could do it if I really wanted to. Um, in this recording, but I don't think I'm going to because, eh, we have plenty of videos here. I think we have three videos in this recording session, which isn't too bad. So, next time in The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, we enter the Goron Mines, the next temple of the game. Obviously, that'll be one video, like all temples are. Because I like to do it all at once instead of splitting it up into five parts. Which is probably what it would have been. Ooh, I can actually climb these things. Um, actually, before we do that, there's actually one other thing that we can do, believe it or not. We can go this way. Hey, wait up, brother. If you're heading down, I recommend using this elevator. Thanks, I was going to do that. That's what I wanted to do. So we can use our iron boots and we can go down. I didn't know we were going to have like a, 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 a transition there, but whatever. <laughs> oh god, I did not mean to do that. Is there a... Stupidness. I did not mean to do that. I just kept falling down by accident. I did not mean to do that. Because... We can push this over. Okay, what that's gonna do is... Remember that while we passed that, there's a rat to the hot springs. Remember I said, oh, we can just get there a lot easier if we went this way? Well, there you go. Um, is there a treasure in this area? I don't think there is. Nope. However, you do also want to go this way. I thought there was a treasure chest in this area, but I guess not. Because you can also push this rock to have an even better shortcut. Right back to where the giant rock is and where this Goron has brought us up initially are, is. So, yep. Shortcuts galore. Next time. On the Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, like I said before, we enter the Goron Mines, second temple of the game. Alright. I will see you guys then.